Hello everybody! In this video I'm going to show you how to remove a hidden Bitcoin mining virus from your computer. Hello friends! If you need to recover deleted data, view or restore removed browsing history, Hetman Software Products will help you. Follow the link in the description, download the necessary program for free, install it and analyze the disk. The utility will show you the data you can recover, so you'll be able to view it or get it back. In our channel and blog you will find solutions to any problem, from installing an operating system or configuring it to fixing possible bugs and errors or optimizing mobile gadgets. Our specialists will answer any questions you ask in your comments under the videos or articles. If you notice that your computer, while you are not using it, still behaves as if it works on a complicated task or if it becomes very slow when dealing even with simple office routine, it could be a mining virus working inside your system. If you never heard of a mining virus, here is the explanation. It's, it is a virus that uses computer resources to generate some cryptocurrency. You can watch one of our videos to learn more about mining cryptocurrencies, find the link in the description. Such mining operations take place automatically without the user's knowledge, and unfortunately your PC won't show you any warnings about it. Software like this can appear on your computer when you download files from doubtful websites. So, before you download an app from a website you never heard of, check the link with the service virus toggle. Just copy the link to the file and paste it into this field to check it. You will see the result and then decide if it's worth downloading <coughs> from such website. You will find the link to this service in the description. This kind of virus makes your computer work at full capacity, so that it can become slow even during simple operations. Continuous work in such conditions affects the computer's hardware, which may break down pretty soon. In the first place, it reduces the lifespan of your graphics card, processor, system memory and even the cooling system. The first sign of a mining virus on your computer is lagging even in simple tasks and the cooler working at maximum speed all the time. If things like that are happening to your computer, try breaking the internet connection or turn off the modem. If the lags have disappeared and the CPU cooler has become considerably quieter, that is almost a certain sign that you've got the mining virus on your PC. Recently such viruses have become very good at disguising themselves. There can be a dedicated process controlling such mining virus and it can suspend the mining activity when you start a resource-intensive game, so that you will never notice any lags or freezes resulting from the virus activity. As soon as you exit the game, the virus will start mining again. And the most dangerous types can even disable antivirus scanners on your PC. So, to detect the virus, the first thing is to scan the computer with an antivirus having the latest database. In case with simple mining viruses, you are not going to have any difficulties. They will be detected easily and removed, but the viruses hiding from the scan will make you try harder than that. A helpful tool in finding a hidden mining app is the Task Manager. Open it by pressing the key shortcuts Ctrl Alt Delete or Ctrl Shift Escape. For some time, watch the active processes, but don't forget to close all programs you are using. If a process puts a lot of load on the system, it could be the virus you are looking for. For example, on my computer there is a process with the name system.xz that makes the operating system work hard. For more information, click on the tab details and find this file here. As you can see, it is launched by the user while such processes should be launched by the system, and it's a certain sign there is a virus. By right-clicking on it, you can search online for more information on this process, or try to end this task, open file location and try removing it if possible. Most mining viruses prefer using the graphics adapter, not the processor. In this case, you may never see them in the task manager, especially on older versions of the Windows operating system. On the contrary, in Windows 10 Task Manager you can see how loaded both the central and the graphics processors are, and if the computer is idle but the load values are close to 100%, your computer is very likely to be mining. Some mining minor viruses can even disable the Task Manager just a few minutes after you start it, and this is also a very prominent sign of threat. Also, some of them may stop when the task manager is started, so you won't see them in the task manager window. However, special software can help you. For example, AIDA, 
Envy Dust Manager, Process Hacker and other similar apps which can track the system load over time. When you start any program from this list, you may find a picture very different from what you see in the Dust Manager. You can find the download links in the description below this video. There are also situations when the Dust Manager shows excessive load from the browser. Then it can be a web mining application that works from a certain website. In this case, you'd better stop using the browser or add an extension to block ads, which will prevent websites from mining on your computer. You can also watch another video about useful browser extensions. The link is below as usual. To remove the virus, scan the system with an antivirus having the latest virus database. You might have a simple mining app which is not hidden, so the antivirus will find and destroy it easily. If it didn't happen, and you find the suspicious app in the task manager, you can try removing it through the registry. To do it, open the run window and use the command regatis. Go to edit. Find, type the virus name and remove any coincidences you have found. If you are not sure that such file can be deleted, then don't remove it, as it can be even more harmful for the system, and if you are going to make any changes to the registry, we recommend exporting the registry file. You can watch another video on our channel to see how. The link is below as usual. If you haven't found anything in the task manager, but the computer behaves strangely, use the utility called Envir Task Manager. Start the program and examine all running processes. If anything looks suspicious, put the cursor on the application to see the information about it. Then right-click on it and select Detailed Info, then Performance. Choose one day to view the load on your PC during this period of time. If the process puts much load on the system, note down its name and path. Right-click on the process and select Kill Process. As you can see, Every process is assigned a risk level to make it easier to monitor viral activities. Follow the given path and try to remove the virus from this folder. Most likely, it will be hidden and you won't see it unless you have enabled showing hidden files. To do it, click on View and check the box next to Hidden Items and the elements will reappear. Or, Give the name of the virus and find it in the registry using the method I have shown before and remove all the coincidences. After that, it is recommended to scan the system again and remove the detected threats, then restart the system. If you don't feel too confident about your antivirus, use one of the portable utilities like Dr. Web Curate. It is often used to search for hidden miners. This is a free utility and you can download it from the official website by following the link below this video. It is important to use the latest version. Just download the program and open it. Start the scanning and wait until it is complete. Then you will see the list of all detected threats and possible actions you can take to eliminate them. And that is all for now. Hit the like button and subscribe to our channel. Leave comments to ask questions. Thank you for watching and good luck!